Good morning. We're so happy you are here with us this morning on this snowy day. Let's begin with our greeting. The Lord be with you. And also with you. Thank you so much. Well, this morning we are going on a hunt. Can you find any clues that tell us that we are in a worship space? How do we know that we are in a church? Do you see anything? Sloan, what do you see? Um, usually you can see stained glass windows. Yeah, stained glass windows. That's a good clue. Yeah. Poppy, how about you? What clue do you see? Um, I, see I see that baptism spot. Yeah, the baptismal font. Yeah, absolutely. All right, how about you? Absolutely, the banner. Yeah, the banner is a good clue. Do you see any clues? Window. Yeah, the windows. Yeah, there are all kinds of clues. And you know what? There are lots of buildings. They are full of clues that tell you where you are. What's a clue that tells you you're in a library? What do you think? Books, that's right. And what about a grocery store? How do you, what clue tells you that you are in a grocery store? All the food. All the food. That's a good clue. Yeah. Well, these things are clues. They're signs that point and tell us what kind of space you're in. Well, this morning during our New Testament lesson, we are going to hear a story about Jesus from the gospel according to John. A long time ago, when the writer wrote the gospel, they wanted us to know some clues about Jesus. Those clues we can find in the stories that they wrote about Jesus. Jesus did miracles. Miracles are signs that point and give us a clue about who Jesus is. When we hear a miracle that Jesus did, it helps us learn more about God. Well, this morning, when we hear our New Testament reading, we can listen and try to hear the miracle, try to hear the sign and the clue that tells us more about God. Well, this morning is a special morning because today is a baptism Sunday. Can anybody find baby Della? Do you see her? Wave to baby Della. <laughs> well, let's sit over here on this side so that we can see baby Della be baptized. Let's promise to be her friend. And then when the baptismal hymn plays, we can make our way back to our pews with our families. Well, before we do that, let's prepare our hearts. Would you join me in our Lord's Prayer? Let's pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. <laughs> 